fish in this shit. Hey guys, welcome back to another Red Beard Outdoors episode. Today we're fishing a small lake in western Kansas. I'm here with my brother and I, I think his fiance is going to show up soon. So uh, let's get to it. We're on a brush pile right now. We're going to do some casting next to it, see if we can catch one. What is that? It's a drum. What is that? Oh! That's not that one. What is that? It's a drum. What is that? Oh! That was a nice one. I ought to play him so much. God dang it. God dang it. Stupid, man. Stupid. Oh! He's got nailed. It's a freaking walleye! Oh, watch out! Freaking walleye, man! <laughs> Easy. I think that's what I lost. Because it didn't look like a bass, it kind of looked like something else earlier. Hmm. I haven't caught a walleye yet this year. Oh dang it. Keep casting at that tree over there. That tree shadow. I need to check out your fish. Gotta send Kelsey a picture. out guys nice little walleye all right let's get him back see ya got the spot lock engaged <laughs> I think uh, there might have been two walleye, and that first one was a walleye and I lost it. Can't do back to back. Yeah, same cast, it went back in there. And I don't know if the same one took it or a different one did. Um, it's not bad to bounce the crankbait on the bottom and make a lot of noise. That's not a bad thing. It's not as mossy and as bad as it was up there. Oh, that was a good place, man. Get it hooked, get it, get it. I thought I did, but I, I put slack in the line. I was trying to turn on my damn GoPro. 
<laughs> See if he hits it again. Spot lock engaged. God, I, I feel kind of stupid. I don't have much GoPro memory card. I'm not letting it like run as much. You see the, the swirl it made? You see that? Kind of. Oh, son of a quack. Yeah. There's another one. Oh, Jandy. <laughs> it's a crop eye. My bad, Shandy. I didn't want to lose it. Little crappy. Little crappy guy. Sorry. Shut. Sorry. Man, if we would have caught a few walleye and some crappie, we should have kept them. Try uh, the front of that brush pile. Get up. Pull them in here. Oh! <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> Put some slack on your. Open up your bail. Pliers are right there. How do I hold it? On it on its belly. Yes. Right there. A little higher. Above its fins. Yeah, like right there. Dang. Hold it tight. Hooked it twice. Ah, oh, hold it, man. All right, back up some. Oh, turn it sideways. And you're blocking it. Turn it the other way. Got it. Hold on. All right, put her in there. Oh! <laughs> Thing that brought us over here. I had to cut something. Hey guys, I've had two missed walleyes and we've both caught one walleye and I caught one crappie. And um, I'm running out of SD card. It's pretty windy too. So I'm only gonna turn you on when uh, I have a fish. So stay tuned. Get up, flip her in. Spot lock. Huh? Spot lock engaged. Another freaking walleye, man. This one's smaller. Those poke you? A little bit. Just hold it tight. 
on the belly there. Grab above the fins, like by the gills. Gills slice you? No. Not if you hold it right. Oh, I barely had it hooked. <laughs> Get a picture of this one. Hold it. Hold it sideways. Other way, you're blocking it. There you go. <laughs> Don't let it snap her. That has teeth, remember? Oh. <laughs> hey, that works pretty good. Uh, trolling or trolling or whatever. Don't tighten it up. Don't boat flip it. Tighten it Here. up. Here. Let me net it. Come on. Bring it again. <laughs> God dang boy. <laughs> Good job. That's a new strategy right there. Here. I gotta keep us from going. I guess I can do this. That's a fish. Is that the same kind of fish? Is that a walleye? Yep. That's all we've been catching. Watch out, Shandy. Shandy. Whoa, look at the fins on his top. Guys, <gasps> get it out of this net. Boy. There. Unhook the fish first. <laughs> wow, this is like seeing a foreign animal to me. <laughs> Hold on. It's got pee. Hold it. Whoa. In pictures, you messed up with this. Can I touch it? <laughs> that was putting up a pretty good fight. I thought I was caught on something. How long can they live with that water? Like like this right now? Oh, what do you think? Maybe 10 minutes at the worst. Maybe. What do you think about that catch, Chase? It's Godzilla. Explain what happened. Oh, we we're trawling along and bam! <laughs> Is that the biggest one you've caught out of them all? Really? Yeah. Nice. He's got both lean in there. Hold on. All right. What happened? They just come loose? <laughs> that was bass. I saw them. It just, it just unhooks? It just unhooked out of his mouth. You want to save you? Huh?
God dang it. It's three today. You gotta be kidding me. Better get ready with the net. It's it's in front of Chase right here. Hurry. Blocking it. Hurry. What, what am I supposed to do? Put it in the net. <laughs> let some, let some, <laughs> Chase, let some slack out. Open your bill up. Man, I'm the best guy to ever. Yeah. Wall head. Okay, voila. Go back there. You gotta hold it so you can show it off. You're blocking it with your thumb. Oh my god. Spin it the other way. Yeah. Spin it the other way. Now you gotta move the net and scoot over. <laughs> oh, now you're really blocking it. Oh my gosh. Good job. Did you get it? No. <laughs> oh my gosh. out of nowhere did it get you <laughs> oh, thanks so much for watching guys sorry I had to uh, do the video this way ran out of SD card and I wanted to catch all the fish action that ended up happening that day so it was, a, it was a long trip, and that's why I ran out of SD card. Went fishing on a previous video. I'll leave a link down in the description below. It's the one where the smallmouth scared the crap out of Shandy, my dog. So, anyways, uh, I retired the lure I was using that day. Uh, I think the hooks have gone bad, and I uh, lost so many fish, and I was getting really angry about it, and I don't think my hooks are sharp anymore, so... I went to Academy to look for some more of that. It's called Sexy Shad and couldn't find any more. Academy's shelves are like bone dry right now, I guess because of the uh, pandemic right now, but I uh, couldn't find any. So I think what I'm going to do is take a file to that and sharpen the hooks. Hopefully that works and I can still use that lure. Uh, it's one of my favorite lures, but um, yeah, I couldn't buy any more. So yeah, it cost me today big time had i don't know like was it three or four fish that i ended up losing and one of them was a pretty nice bass um as you guys saw not very fun when you lose fish like that but my brother on the other hand he was catching them so kudos to him i'm a really good guide by the way and chase you're welcome for that so anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please hit that like button make sure to subscribe and I will see you guys on the next Red Beard Outdoors episode. Remember, get outdoors and keep fishing. I'll catch you guys on the next Red Beard Outdoors episode.